In this video, we are going to talk about how to block certain IPs so that they won't be able to visit your WordPress website. So if you are interested in protecting your WordPress website from malicious traffic, then let's dive in. Hi, my name is Ankit and welcome to Magazine 3 YouTube channel where we talk about everything related to WordPress. And if you want to learn more about WordPress, then make sure you subscribe to this channel and hit the notification bell so that you can get notified whenever we upload our next video. So in our series of WordPress security for beginners, in this episode, we are talking about how you can block certain IPs to stop them visiting your WordPress website. Now you have your WordPress website live and it is getting some traffic now, but recently you realize that there are certain IPs that are doing some suspicious uh, visiting or doing some suspicious things on your WordPress website and you want to block them. For any reason you want to block some IPs or the range of IPs from your WordPress website, then you can easily install some security or firewall plugin and then do that. So let's go ahead and dive in in the WordPress backend and I'll show you how you can do it. So here we are in our WordPress backend and we are using the same website that we have used in the previous episode. So in which we talked about how you can track the live traffic on your website server. So if you want to watch that video, you can watch the complete playlist in the I button above. So we have already installed WordFence security plugin. So we will go on that. So we click on dashboard and we got bunch of options in this plugin. So our main concern is to block certain IPs. So there are two ways you can do that with this plugin. So either we can go to tools. And in the live traffic section, we scroll down. We have all these visitors coming on our website. And that's actually me just opening the website incognito mode. So let me just open my VPN server and then we will visit the website again. And then we will try to block that visitor. So let me just open the website in a new incognito mode. So now we see that we have a new visitor coming from San Francisco and it's considering this as human. So we are using the Lime VPN. So as you can see here, it's considering the host as Lime VPN. So now if I want to block this visitor, I just need to click on this name or anywhere on this uh, row. So it will open up all the details and now I can block this IP. So let me just block this. So now this visitor is blocked. So let's try to refresh the front end that we have opened in this window. So let's refresh it. And now you see that I am not authorized to visit this website. If someone is trying to visit my website and they think that they have been blocked by mistake, so they can contact me and then I will unlock the IP address. So that's a simple way that you can block anyone from the live traffic and that visitor will be no more be able to see your WordPress website. Another way is that you can take the IP address of this visitor like this. We can copy that. So let me just unlock this IP from here. So let's unblock it. Let's refresh the website. So now you see we are back. It's now opening fine. So now we have copied the IP address. We go to firewall and here we have an option for blocking. We go to this option and if we scroll down, we have block type as IP address. We can enter the IP address here and we can type in the reason, maybe just test and we will block this IP. Now this IP address is added in our block list. So let's go ahead and refresh this page again. So now you see for this IP address, the website is blocked again. So by this option, you can enter as many IP address as you want and you can block them all. And you can do the same IP blocking by not just WordFriends. There is also a plugin called iTheme Security, which you can install and it's pretty popular as well. And that also you can use to block certain IP or the list of IPs and restrict these visitors or these IP address to visit your WordPress website. So this is how easy it is to install a simple firewall plugin and then block some IP addresses to stop some malicious activity or some suspicious activity or visitors from your WordPress website. So I hope you like this video and if you want to learn more about WordPress security, then make sure you watch our complete playlist of WordPress security for beginners. The link is in the i button above and the video description below. 
And if you want to learn more about WordPress, then make sure you subscribe to this channel and hit the notification bell so that you can get notified whenever we upload our next video. So that's it for this one and I'll see you in the next one.